where we said, let me know when you get near and I'll wave. I'm wearing that jacket you like. Okay, bye. Love you. Bye. Nice to see some younger people out today. I'm just waiting on someone. For a, good, bringing friends, good. If there's any bother, look for the people with the high vis. I don't think we're expecting any trouble today. Trouble? Is something happening? Is something happening? Is something happening, she says. Oh, I use they them pronouns. Thank you. Noted. Oh, is that something happening? Oh, now. Join us. Bring your friend. Oh, no, it's not really. Well, we are friends, but it's more of a... It's... It's a date, actually. <laughs> At a protest, how thrilling. Oh, we didn't actually know the protest was on. <laughs> Still, how exciting. Tell me who, tell me all. <laughs> oh, uh, oh, my blood sugar. <laughs> now you were saying, I'm something of a romantic at heart. <laughs> okay, her name's Jess. We've been best friends for ages, but we've only just admitted that we like each other. She's not out to her family or anything like that yet, so we thought we'd just come into town, have a nice chill one, nothing massive, but now there's all this on. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> Still, you can't, you have to say, with all these people lending their voices to the common good, isn't it a sight for sore eyes? It is, but today? <laughs> well, it's most Saturdays now. We have sister protests all across the UK. London, Newcastle, Manchester, Birmingham. There's even one in Swansea. <laughs> we have a Facebook group. We're all over the internet now, actually. My niece showed me. Um, did you not see us? Oh, I, I block a lot of political content. Oh. <laughs> Roger, back again. <laughs> I am. Excellent. This seat taken. Oh, oh no. no. Six I am not been up since. All Carol had to do was get the bottle water, but did she know some muggins here had to drive to the big Tesco on the other side of town at eight o'clock this morning? All this. They are killing me. I've got new walking boots and they're rubbing. I need a minute already. We've not even started yet. <laughs> <laughs> this yours. Busy then. You won't believe it. Christine. Oh, Liv. Nice to meet you joining us. Oh, no, I, I don't really. We don't have time. Don't have time today. What could you possibly be doing in town if not coming to lend your voice to the fall of the oppressor? <laughs> have a date. With a girl. I met my wife at a peace rally in the 90s, been together ever since. I'm just saying, first date at a protest might be good luck. Could be. I want to ask it to be my girlfriend. On your first date? Young love. <laughs> Never anything quite like it, is there? Do you have somebody, Roger? Roger's a solitary creature, aren't you? I had a very dear friend in the 80s. I thought that might have been something. He moved to London. We spoke on the phone occasionally. The parties he spoke of. Soho, Vauxhall, Camden. <laughs> and he stopped calling. There's been no one since. 
What's the latest with your sweetheart? She would tell me if she wasn't coming. She would. Wouldn't she? Well, come on then, you'll join us in the meantime, won't you? Get yourself up the front. We need to get going. I I'll wait here with Liv. I'll catch you up. They can speak for themselves. Liv, what do you think? It's fine. I don't like politics. <laughs> Don't like it. <laughs> Not really. <coughs> you are going on a date with a girl. So? Christine, they're only young. I bet you're more than happy to skip around the pride with rainbows on your face, wearing your bloody flag like a superhero, okay? Everyone likes that. They like it now. They didn't always. We don't get to just sit back and let politics happen as if it's separate from us. This bloody government's already made it quite clear. They couldn't give a rat's ass about you and me. Christine. Am I wrong? Look. <sighs> they there. cannot speak to them like that. There is no excuse for ignorance. Look, I know what's going on. You can't avoid it. You're there just trying to eat your breakfast and it's death, destruction, politicians saying horrible things. I just don't get involved. That's worse. That's exactly what's wrong with all people right, today. All right, all right. You said your piece. They're going to spend time with their sweetheart and up. Roger. No. You always do this. This. You can't blame people for wanting to put their own happiness before dealing with all this illness in the world. But you have to deal with it. People are going to put their agenda onto you whether you like it or not, so you might as well get involved. But we'll be together. Out in public. Courting in public. Isn't that the point? Benefiting from years of hard work by other people and then refusing to take the baton. You can't force people. You can't protect them either. I'm not... Roger. <coughs> Oh, oh. I, I've come over all, all funny. Oh, it's blood sugar. It's sandwich. Oh, hang on. Oh. Still got these in here from Christmas. Oh. Are you all right? Roger? Oh, I'm sorry, mate. I didn't mean to get you all worked up. And sorry for sitting on your sandwich. You never know when to stop. That's why I like you so much. <laughs> I can stay with him if you want. Your date? Don't you dare. <laughs> why do you spend your whole lives doing all of this? Why don't you just, like, go on holiday or something? Because I believe that change is possible, fool that I am. Mm. Slowly, incrementally, but I don't think they're just going to give it to us. They're not going to get off their asses unless we shove them. Like the horse. The horse? Yeah, there's this horse in the field by us and he spends so much time asleep that the owner had to put a sign up in the field saying that he was asleep because everyone kept thinking he was dead. <laughs> Tried everything, the owner. Being nice to the horse, shouting at the horse, but the horse just didn't want to do anything. And they're the horse. <laughs> they're the horse. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry for going off at you, love. No, I, I do want to be more aware of things. It's just hard to take it all in. I know, I do. You know, it's such a long time since I had a conversation like this with people like me. Yeah, I mean, I don't know any other queer people, apart from Jess, but I guess our friendship's the most important thing in my life. She's not the only one you know anymore. I wouldn't call myself queer. Nor would I, but... It does seem as though we're all a bit... Bit gay? <laughs> <laughs> we go to a walking group for lesbians. 
hikes and nature walks mostly. Some days I would rather just walk to the pole. <laughs> <laughs> we had a group, men's group, second Thursday. Then COVID happened and we could never get the numbers up again. Committed bunch. Now don't start. There was too many problems for a lot of them. Transport let them down or they couldn't be open with their families about where they were coming to and that caused problems. It was always the people who needed the group too. I'm quite lucky. I can live my life as open as I can. A lot of those men can't. And they're the ones that lose out now the group's not happening. <laughs> Isn't that Carol waving at you? I'll go and tell her. I'll be back. I don't want to fuss. Shush you. How are you then, really? Much better now, thank you. You know, you didn't have to offer to stay with me. Oh, I wasn't going to leave you sitting here all nervous. I'm not nervous. Oh my God, she's message. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay, so her, her signal was shit on the train, but she's nearly here. Well then, get yourself off. I'm not leaving you. You are? You're not where? This isn't my first funny turn, and it won't be my last. <laughs> listen, listen to me now. You go and meet that girl and hold her hand in the middle of the city centre and enjoy yourselves. With all these people around, enjoy yourselves, will you? Roger, she can join us here. These protests are for you. Fine, they're not for everyone. Be out as yourself also takes courage. And sometimes that's just enough. Are you being here next week? As long as there are idiots ruling this country, I shall be here. <laughs> I can come back. And tell me how it went. Yeah, I can see how you are. I'm fine. But it will be nice to see you. Thank you. What are you standing here for? Go! Go! 